Hello and welcome to Starcraft Wednesday. I'm going to do a 1v1 today. Um, first off, I'd like to say, well, it's a ZVP for anyone wondering. Um, I'd like to apologise for the lack of content being released. Um, it's like over the past few days, well, no, weeks even. See, it's going to be really hard because I can't talk and play at the same time. Um, I have tried to render videos and upload them and the rendering of the videos, a 20 minute long video that was last week and the week before, both came out as 57, 56 second rendered videos which when I uploaded obviously it was only 50 sec 56 seconds of the clip of the entire video and therefore it was pretty much crap. So I apologise for them not being anything, hopefully I can get this one out to you and actually have some content released <laughs> on time. Um, I don't know if I've done many 1v1s since I was in bronze. In fact, the last one I did was probably holding off a zealot rush where I analyzed a replay, which is probably horrible looking back at it now. But yeah, we're going to go for a 14, 14, so 14 gas, 14 pool. Um, you don't really want to go hatch first against Protoss for the fact that um, cannon rush is going to occur quite easily. So as soon as that 14th drone comes out, well 14th supply drone comes out, you want to get the um, gas going straight from it. And as soon as that one pops, the 15th one, put the pool down. That I learnt from watching D Apollo. Um, so yeah, Th yeah, watching his walkthrough of like basically, well basically a walkthrough of Zerg. And he's done a Protoss one as well, for anyone interested. You just have to search for like D Apollo um the Zerg tutorial, I guess. Um gonna try and go for an expansion around twenty. So yeah, this guy's forge fast expanding weirdly. Okay. Well, I say weird. I I'm not obviously I'm not pro, so but really know what's weird and what's not but from what I know that's kind of weird so yeah should be able to get that and that and should have got that overlord one earlier that's a that's a definitely a pie one whether there's cannons I don't know why are you all the way over there oh you chased that one didn't you so we're gonna get another one going down there and another true one out so yeah, we should be expanding somewhere around now. Um, can pull out gas for quite a while. This is just what I do. It's not like I don't know. It could be good. Could be bad. Oh, time for revenge. And expand and go back to here. Inject. Get some more drones out. Okay, so with Forge Fast Expand, you can expect to drone until about eight minutes. Um, I don't like. I, I I'm indecisive about this because every time I do it, I seem to die. So I usually go to about seven thirty, and then and then um, go roaches. So I can get my roach round about now, and this pops out and get Overlord. And this one's in permission to position even. So you can go scout. Probably should have scouted a bit earlier. Get into the overlord on the queue. You can sit over there. So with the high ground you can't really see out. These should have the watchtowers. And we'll see what our overlord can see. Not much as of yet. In an expansion. Certainly new news. Let's see if we can get a link up there. Let's see what that is. Is it pipe? Oh, it's a cannon. Don't even try, mate. Don't even try. So, yeah. We could try and keep nailing those injects. You can go in there. You can transfer down. You can get. Nope. So, my overlord's being killed now. Nearly. I'm going to need another. I can get another queen out now. 
and an Evo chamber. If I start my upgrades early. Oh yeah. Bloody supply block. Mark things. I always do this. I always seem to send all my drones to my expansion and then have nothing left. That's cute. Get that one to inject. See. Right, there we go. And so it's seven thirty now I start building roaches. As I said, this is just me. Whether it's good or not is a different matter. So this queen's gonna start getting some creep out. I really need to work on that supply box. That is seems to be a big issue with me. Right, you can be on the way. And I can take this gas and these gases. Keep spreading that creep. We require more Vespine gas. Get some more drones. So round about now you should see a push coming out, which I haven't, so I'm worried. Unless my timings are completely off here. In which case I would love for people to tell me. I'd rather be wrong and someone correct me than zealots. Okay. As I was trying to say, I'd rather be wrong and someone correct me than just be wrong and never know. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna go roaches because we haven't seen much of anything else. If we do have an Evo chamber down, if um, in fact that's a good idea. If you put a spark crawl at the entrance, then can always just uh, detect anything. Oh ho! There we are. And please tell me if I'm overreacting on this. I don't think I am, but oh god, another layer. Not good. This is the point where I'm tempted to just go, well, screw it then. I'm gonna get loads of brooches. If I get two more queens. Aha! This is what I usually do and die to it. Because I, <laughs> I look for that <laughs> those void rays and I'm like, right, I'm gonna stop those void rays. Forget about the ground army. So yeah, I can probably use... Oh god. This may not go well. Need to keep that queen alive. In fact, no, target that one, target that one. Run away, run away, run away. Nope. <laughs> she didn't run away. I'm not getting in there. Go kill that. Good job I had more in production. Okay, go try and take an expansion. Oh, damn it, I shouldn't have run both those. You get in. Right, now I have defence. Sufficient defence. I'm sending all my roaches. Not like they can do anything. My queens can though. Because my queens are awesome. So let's keep that creep spread growing. And. Can I go this way? They're gonna go 
that way when you get the chance. Let's try and connect these bases, make sure I'm not too overexposed. Please tell me, yes, I do. Oh god. Yep, supply box is definitely something I need to work on. Gotta make sure I'm still building those units. The hive cluster is under attack. We cancel it if needs be. Nope. <laughs> Failed that. And there we go. You're dead. I don't think I'm doing too bad here. Probably should tech up. And whoa, okay, yeah I am. Having a look at that gas and minerals. Safe to say, um, not exactly exemplar. You can convert. I'll be impressed. Oh, he's gone for a third. I think my noise. Oh no, not noise. Starts. This is the sort of thing you notice. Right, we're gonna have to go barrel down his front at some point. So after that comes out, spread our creep once more. Don't know where I'm going with this because I'm just gonna jump that gap. Hopefully. I've yet to learn this um, backspace thing. Um, for those of you players there, will probably know we use backspace to get the to cycle through bases. I have not learned that. Yet. Oh come on! He's just out of reach. 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 <laughs> well then. Go see if he likes being harassed as much as I do. Oh, and then, ooh, colossi. Alright, this is where I dump all my minerals into gas. And minerals and gas, even. Let's see his upgrades. 1 1. Okay. So we've got him on the upgrades. Oh, I get plus one. Keep injecting. Should have got a micro hatch a long time ago. Let's take that. And I think this is GG to be honest. Not really much you can do. We require more Vespin gas. Let's take out that. Double cost eye production, so that's pretty good by him. Triple class high production. How long has he been on three bases? Have well, I just been completely blind to this? Keep injecting. Oh no, GG. Well, thank you for watching that. <laughs> That's probably a pretty poor display of playing, but um, I enjoyed it. And ZVP, top 8 gold. 
That doesn't really mean much right now since the new season's just started. But I'm in gold now for those who you want to know. Um, so yeah. Uh, hopefully this renders. And if it doesn't then I'll have to explain it again next week. So I'll see you next time on Stack Up Wednesdays.